Coming from Brenner Pass and approaching the old mining town of Vipiteno, the center of the southern Whip Valley, we can already see its landmark, the Zwolva Tower, from the distance. It is definitely worth taking a stop at this picturesque small town. Westwards, there is the Redana Valley, with lush meadows, picturesque hills and small villages, probably one of the most beautiful high valleys in the Alpine region. Countless runlets and streams have trenched the valley slopes and shaped, in the course of millennia, trenches and a few romantic but wild canyons such as the Gilfen Klum close to Stange. Extended forests, alpine meadows, mountain lakes, endless mountain ranges and finally the glacier and high mountain region with its highest peak, the Zuckerhütl at 3507 meters above sea level characterized the scenery. Throughout the centuries, the valley has been influenced by the life and the work of the mountain farmers. In spite of the increasing mechanization and the flourishing tourism, the old traditions, uses and customs remain deeply rooted and very present. Not only the fields at the bottom of the valley, but also the meadows on the slopes, the forests, the mountain pastures and meadows have been treated and cultivated. Traditional big ancient farms were transformed into characteristic cultivated hamlets. The traditional production and processing of homemade products is highly regarded. The great scenery of the Redana Valley is particularly inviting for hikers. Everyone is delighted by the beautiful nature and finds his preferred hiking opportunity. From the relaxed walk in the valley, over light hikes through the forests towards the alpine meadows and the cattle herds, up to climbing tours in the high mountains. Many alpine huts and refuges at an altitude of up to more than 3000 meters invite us for rest and refreshment for a relaxed chat with the locals, for generous information and help. Mountain bike tours, paragliding, carriage rides, horseback riding tours and a seemingly endless wellness and fitness program at the hotels offer opportunities for an active, exciting, relaxing and delightful vacation. Some of the young sports enthusiasts, such as the biathletes in this area, already start their training for the competitions in summer. During almost a millennium, masses of miners were bringing to light precious silver, lead and zinc under extreme climatic circumstances and harsh working conditions. Only in 1985 the mine was closed and transformed into a tourist mine, 
the Bergbau Welt Ridnan Sneeberg, Mining Museum of Ridan and Montaneve, a project which is unique in Europe. Here the tourists can literally dive into the mining activity, since the entire production chain of a mine has been conserved, from strenuous ore mining and transportation up to ore processing. We can experience the whole process. Also, the small showroom with the giant statue of Maria Fassnauer from Redana is very impressive. She was called the Giant of Tyrol, as during her lifetime around the year 1900, she was the tallest lady of the world. The miner's uniform in the Knappen Chapel, Miner's Chapel, recalls the year-long mining tradition at Montaneve and the former prestige of the miners. Hunting and fishing are among the most ancient occupations of humankind. The Hunting and Fishing Museum is located in the splendid Baroque Castle Wolfstern in Moretta. It offers cultural and historic information about wildlife and hunting, about the popular art of hunting and about fishery in an entertaining style. We encounter excellent conditions for skiing in the nearby skiing resort of Racine's Monte Giobo, which is equipped with state-of-the-art cable car and service facilities and 25 kilometers of ideally groomed slopes. Is there a more beautiful place for cross-country skiing than Redana? The scenery, the guaranteed snow and the perfectly groomed cross-country tracks are simply ideal. Ridana has developed into a centre of biathlon and cross-country skiing. Not only national and international races take place there, but sport groups from abroad have already chosen the valley as an optimal place to prepare for competitions. Meanwhile, more and more people take advantage of the delightful winter scenery for hiking or for skiing tours through the deep, unspoiled powdery snow for tobogganing and snowshoe hiking. Well, we wish you a pleasant stay in Redana. <laughs>